Hello you guys, this is Slappy Panda Guy here and welcome back to another Robots video. This is not a gameplay this time, surprisingly, but as you can see I am on Roblox Studio, on the Roblox Studio program and um, I wanted to um, tell you, let you guys know that I'm actually doing something on Roblox which is pretty interesting. It's not like, unfortunately it's not a collaboration or anything, this is actually just me making the game. And you can see that I'm actually turned the camera away, so it's a surprise, really. So I want to get this straight. So uh, a year ago, I did two obbies, which were meant to be like adventure obbies. Well, there was one kind of fun one, which is the SpongeBob one. So I did the SpongeBob one, and I did the Freddy Fazbear obby, and it's still available on my page, and you guys can check it out. But I'm not sure if the badges are working now because since um, that I don't have Builders Club. I think that the badges are disabled, but you can still play the game. But I just think, well, I think you can actually get badges, but I don't have Builders Club because um, some people get their badge rewards, which I see on my um, on on my chart that's saying that people have got badge rewards. So I think that's probably a different rule I'm talking about. So I think that. It's now changed but anyways um this is an obby i'm doing and unfortunately it's not a venture obby so you can just like jump out of planes or run around the city or anything it's not like that unfortunately because that will probably take a while and um i don't know when's that gonna happen but um so i i wanted to do this uh obby was because um there's so many clickbait obbies that I always like in the thumbnail because there was like thumbnails that I kind of were interested in making like escape obbies but I don't want to make my games of course not clickbaitable so basically you see a nice picture of basically escape the poo obby and then you play the game and there's no poo in there and it's just basically a fun obby with nothing to escape from so yeah so here is the preview, it's currently unfinished, there's only like 18 stages and I'm getting it up to 50 and um, this obby that I'm doing is all about Anthro because since Anthro has been a lot of rumours and things like that um, on Roblox and that, I just thought it would be a bit funny to have an obby of him, <laughs> escape Anthro obby, but um, yeah like I said in other video when I talked about Anthro, I said um, he looks fine, I like the model and this and that, but he doesn't look suitable to be in the Roblox uh, world or anything because he looks like a human then a blocky person really. He looks like he's from another game, like he doesn't belong really to Roblox, he think he's like somewhere else. But um, anyways, so this obby that I'm doing is all about Anthro at the moment. I was thinking about doing the Halloween one because it's Halloween coming up soon and I thought it would be great to have like skeletons and vampires and dead body zombies and stuff for over here which is interesting but um this obby is all about the orange because that's my because that's um Anthro's theme is orange and um this obby will be changed for like maybe every two weeks so if it will be Anthro it probably be uh for instance Spongebob and uh, the next two weeks it will probably be, uh, you know, Family Guy or uh, The Simpsons or um, like anything really. It change like I can change different things like Escape the Poo, etc. So I can just change the color of the uh, platforms here. So the orange is meant to match his uh, shirt, but even though it's not really that matching, but. Um, so for instance, if I wanted to do a SpongeBob obby, these uh, platforms here, these orange platforms will be turned to yellow and the red, and we're still going to put it as red because um, because red is very known for um, to avoid things and that and I don't want to make these obbies confusing for people to know like which colour is sensible to touch and which colour is not sensible to touch. So um, yeah. So this is meant to be the starting point here, so there's like a little lobby room here so you can just like um, chill in here or something, like you know, like a stand here. And then you start with this one where, um, you know, you got the, um, 
one like which one of these are safe to cross so ones which you, you could clip through and some that you you can't clip through so yeah and there's other ones here i've recently did the star one the star jumping it's pretty random of course because it's the random mobby and this is and this little uh point here um, i put it there just to help me uh count up in all my calculations of the stages that i've finished so i've got 16 out of 50 so i have got um 30 more stages to go so i just did this room with the cracked um wall here which the wall is quite safe but these uh lines here are not safe so um, it's pretty interesting and it's very random of course but it's it's because this is a random mobby and you can just put anything random on here so i just put stars lego bricks um over here some hearts just some round balls over there and some poo and these are the current uh, objects that i'm going to add on here so i'm going to add a starbucks coffee just because you know it's it, it's like a it's like a made up sort of um version of starbucks because uh, i just felt like adding just random objects on here so yeah and we got this like box here this oh this is like a cube and then we got this um wooden box here so yeah that's currently still on a progress to um you know you know yeah other obbies uh, other stages so i just want to let you guys know that this obby will be always be up to date so um so for instance like you know if and if the Anthrax Obby's been like over a week, I would change it to something else and change the theme into maybe Halloween or a cartoon character or something. Just like you will see like fun Obby's where they always keep being changing up to date and that. And I have the problem is when I make these Obby's is that the checkpoint scripts can sometimes be messed up. So it's like when I put a checkpoint there, sometimes its registration just comes to a fail and it doesn't even register you properly. So I have to find some script codes and how to figure out how to solve the issues of checkpoints, which is hard to explain because I think you guys don't um, well don't really understand much about uh, game making and stuff and obby making because it's all about codes and things. But this is like the trickiest issue. But making obbies is pretty easy and you can just test it out on your you know testing button here. But Yep, so there's my checkpoint here. This is just a testing regular um, marker here. And um, let me just solid all of this first so nothing goes flying out of the map. So um, I felt like adding the water placement here, but I don't really know because it looks kind of cool. It's like a more like a wipeout <clears throat> sort of obby, but uh, with the water underneath and that. But the water is solid so if you fall into it you die but you don't sink in out of the map you actually lay on top of the water which i don't think it really makes sense if you fall out of the map because it kind of um looks kind of look a little bit unprofessional or something it just kind of does to me in my opinion so um yeah it would be great if i add like a fact of water where if your bodies and pieces fall into it it actually you know floats into the air so it falls in there and then the water pushes it up and then it makes it a little bit realistic so yeah okay so let me just show you a preview there we go okay so i'm on this checkpoint here so you have to um okay jump on these uh hearts oh my gosh It's a little bit laggy, I do apologise. Okay, so in this one you just walk along. Try not to touch the walls. Some are pretty easy, some are just a little bit challenging, but um There's this one here, this one's remade really up, so um it's kind of like strings. There we go. And you got poo and you can actually clip through it sort of. So um, this is like the examples here, so yeah, and um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, I uh, feel I'm just going to end it right here because I do not want to repeat myself multiple times, but anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, please give this video a big thumbs up and comment down below what you think of this video, you can leave any requests in the comments of what game should I play next, either it's in Roblox or outside of Roblox, 
and um, you can also let me know which sort of escape obby you want me to do in that if I can or it must be very uh, sensible and stuff so uh, yeah um, I might not definitely won't do your quest unfortunately but it may be a good idea if you just send me one and I probably might be interested like probably like the toilet or the poo or a cartoon character or some popular game character and I can put it on there and um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you for watching.